Hello, I'm Maria Aguirre with the Office of Diversity and Inclusion at SNHU. I stand up against hate by actively challenging bias and discriminatory language and hate speech. I educate myself on the lived experiences of diverse communities and do my best to stand up for and with those who are actively attacked for simply being themselves. I urge you to stand with me by educating yourself and those around you on how prejudice and stereotypes hurt all members of our society and what we can do to change it. I stand up against hate by calling it out when I see it. Eli Wiesel once said, I swore never to be silent whenever and wherever human beings endure suffering and humiliation. We must always take sides. Neutrality helps the oppressor, never the victim. Silence encourages the tormentor, never the tormented. My name is Jared Campbell with the Office of Diversity and Inclusion and I stand up against hate. I stand up against hate by speaking up when I see something. I also try to gather all the facts and educate myself as best as I can. I also try to create safe and welcoming spaces for everybody. Hello, I'm Jada Hebra and I stand up to hate by trying to figure out what's at the bottom of it. Usually people who hate are suffering and they're in a lot of pain. And as hard as it is to try to engage someone who's saying hateful things or doing hateful things, that's usually the best way to diffuse it. So I try, I try to reach out with love to counteract the hate. Hey everybody, I am Jonathan Wesley and I stand up against hate by publicly speaking out against it. And as I encourage you to do the same thing, this song comes to mind and it simply says, It's been a long, a long time coming, but I know a change is gonna come. Oh, yes it will. So as you stand up against hate, know that a change is going to come. Take care. Hi, my name is Helena Iaquinta, and I wanted to share the ways that I stand up to hate. Southern Poverty Law Center has a set of 10 steps that I highly recommend, and here's a quick snippet. Educate yourself. Realize the impact of the things you say. Teach acceptance. Respect all cultures, races, and walks of life. Ask yourself curious questions about the systems and structures in place, and be willing to challenge them and use whatever skills and means you have to simply take action. I stand up against hate by not letting my fear of being attacked for being Chinese keep me from leaving my home. I stand up against hate by standing up for others when I see them being harassed just for existing. I stand up against hate because I want my niece to live in a world where she can be proud of her heritage without fear of being attacked. In order to do this, I need your help. If you see a fellow human being harmed in some way, Please say something, stand up for them when they can't and show their attacker that they can't get away with hateful behavior. We're going to include some links to some free bystander intervention trainings that will help you know when and how to speak up, step in, or call for help.